Hello friends, welcome back to this video. In this video, we'll be talking about noise. I have already introduced noise in one of my previous videos. I hope you all have seen that video. If not, the link is available in the description box below. So now here in this video, we'll be talking about some terminologies related to noise. So for that, you need to know what is noise first. And that is why I recommended you to watch my previous video first. So here in this video, we'll be talking about the SNR of the noise. After that, we'll be talking about the noise figure amplifier noise, Friss formula and noise temperature. We'll be talking about figure of merit as well. So the first term is SNR. As the name suggests, it is the signal to noise ratio. So it is the ratio of the signal power to the noise power. So I can say SNR is equal to signal power upon noise power. So now if I take the amplitude of the signal to be Vs and the amplitude of the noise to be Vn, so signal to noise ratio would be signal power which is proportional to the Vs square upon noise power which is proportional to the Vn square. So now coming to the next term, it is noise figure. So to compute noise figure, I must know about a term which is noise factor. So noise factor can be computed with the help of a two port network. So this is my two port network. So what happens in the two port network? I have two input as well as two output. So what is two input? So it is PSI. PNI, PSI represents the signal power, PNI represents the noise power at the input. So here I will be having PSO, the signal power at the output and the noise power at the output. So this is my two port network. So now here the noise factor is given by SNR of the input upon SNR of the output. So I hope now you are clear with the SNR. So SNR of input can be found out using PS input upon PN input upon SNR of the output will be PS output upon PN output. So now here I can represent it as PS input into Pn output upon Pn input into Ps output. So now here this is the two port network having the gain G. So now here the Ps output will be equal to gain multiplied with the Ps input. This is my output power. Output power is the input power multiplied by the gain. So now I will replace PS output so here F will be equal to PS input into PN output upon PN input into PS output so here I'll be putting G PS input and these two are cancelled out so F is equal to PN output upon G into PS input so now from here I can calculate that PN output will be equal to this G PS input will multiply here. So here I will be having F G PS input. So now, sorry this was PN input. Because PS and PS were get, were get cancelled out. So now here PN output is equal to F into G into PN input. So what is PN input? Where? Pn input was equal to K into T into B. So I have already talked about this. So now what will be Pn output? Pn output will be F G K T B. So now here you can see this is my two port network having the gain G and the output power is equal to G times input power. Now if I talk about the output noise output noise is not equal to g times the input noise here we have additional term which is f 
so now here if i subtract f g k t b minus the input power which is k t b will be having f minus 1 k t b so this is the additional noise added by the amplifier so this is my amplifier noise so i hope it is clear how you can find out the amplifier noise so now it is also clear that how you can find out this noise factor so now here if i need to find out noise figure so noise figure is tan log of 10 of noise factor so first i need to find out what is my noise factor then with the help of this formula i can easily find out noise figure so now this is my amplifier noise so the ratio of noise at amplifier will be so it will be f minus 1 into ktb upon f ktb which is equal to f minus 1 upon f so this is the ratio of the amplifier noise so this is how i can represent my amplifier noise in the ratio form so now coming to the fritz formula so now fritz formula is applicable to the cascading of the network so here i just have one network with gain g so now here if i have more than one network so this is my first amplifier so here i have g1 and noise factor f1 it is connected to the second amplifier so this is second amplifier having g2 and noise factor f2 similarly it is connected to the third amplifier it is having g3 and f3 and so on so i can have more amplifier as well so it is connected here to a resistance and it is connected to the voltage device so now here we'll be seeing how much noise is present in this system so now here if i want to find out the output figure of merit of these cascading of systems so the output figure of merit will be equal to f1 plus f2 minus 1 upon g1 so i have taken the factor of second system so now factor of second amplifier minus 1 upon gain of first amplifier so i'll be adding it to the factor of third amplifier minus 1 upon gain of first amplifier multiplied by gain of second amplifier plus so on so let's suppose if i have one more amplifier connected to it so what would be the amplifier possessing in the terms of noise factor so it will be f4 minus 1 upon g1 g2 g3 so now i hope you understood i'll be writing it here f4 minus 1 upon g1 g2 g3 so this is how i can add more number of amplifiers and i can find out the output noise factor so from here i can calculate the figure of merit as well so now here if you understood how i can find out the output noise factor so this formula only represents the fritz formula so now this is my fritz formula now coming to the noise temperature so noise temperature is actually another representation of noise figure so i was representing noise figure in the terms of noise factor now here i'll be representing another term which represents noise so noise temperature is also representing the noise when we have noise in the system it will induce some temperature so it is just representing again the noise figure so k t e b represents the noise 
temperature so it is equal to f minus 1 so here this is the noise temperature t so it is equal to f minus 1 k t b so now here you can see the noise temperature will be equal to t is equal to f minus 1 into t b which implies t upon sorry b is also not there so t upon t will be equal to f minus 1 so now if i have to represent this Fritz formula in the term of noise temperature so what i'll do i'll subtract one from the right hand side as well as left hand side so f minus 1 will be equal to f1 minus 1 plus f2 minus 1 upon g1 plus f3 minus 1 upon g1 g2 plus so on so now i know what is f minus 1 f minus 1 is te upon t so it is equal to te1 upon t plus f2 minus 1 will be te2 upon t into g upon g1 plus f3 minus 1 will be te3 upon t upon g1 g2 so now i can cancel out all the t which are in denominator so te will be equal to te1 plus te2 upon g1 plus te3 upon g1 into g2 plus so on so now this is the representation of the Fritz formula in the terms of noise temperature so i also told you that i'll be talking about the figure of merit so the figure of merit is actually the representation of the signal so how effective is my signal in the terms of noise so it is actually opposite of the noise factor so here I have figure of merit is equal to SNR of output upon SNR of input. So it will be equal to so PS output upon PN output upon PS input upon PN input. So now figure of merit if it is greater than 1 which means output SNR SNR output so I'll be writing it here so it means SNR output is greater than SNR input and now if figure of merit is less than 1 which means the output SNR is lesser than the input SNR so what does it mean so if you have a lot of videos which are present on the YouTube so only some videos are desirable others are non desirable which are noise so the desirable upon non desirable is the signal to noise ratio and from here I can compute that how effective is my signal in the terms of noise so I hope now you understood what is figure of merit as well so here I'll be concluding my session I hope you understood each and everything which I discussed in this video if you still have any doubt you can put the doubt in the comment and I'll try to resolve it as soon as possible I hope you like this video if you like it share it with your friends subscribe the channel and push the like button thank you